Hi, and welcome to Directable. Today we'll be going over how to use the Mi Box Android Media Player with Directable for a digital signage system. This is the Mi Box just after I've removed the packaging. Here I have added labels to the device and remote to help keep better track of them. The box comes with a player, a remote with batteries, HDMI cable, and a power cable. To connect to a TV, all you really need is a TV with an HDMI input. You can see the HDMI cable is connecting the Mi Box player to the TV. Here I put in an HDMI 1. Now once we have the uh, everything plugged in, we'll turn the TV on, plug the media player in, and it'll start to load. Android loads up. So take just a second, and I may have edited this down a little bit so you're not watching everything load up. First thing it'll do is say choose your language. Today we're going to use English. Uh, we're not going to connect it with a tablet here, so we're going to connect no. Uh, connect it to your Wi-Fi is the next step. We'll choose our Wi-Fi, and then hit the uh, type in the password, and click next. Successfully connected, there you go. Now, with this Android-based system, you need to connect it to a Google account. So if you don't have one, sign up for one. So we're going to go to use your password for your Google account and select the email address connected to that Google account, type that in, and then the password. Once you do that, you click Accept, Sign In, and Success. Here you are. A couple more steps here just to agree to. Uh, your location, terms and condition, uh, help improve Android, sure. That'll take us to, once we're done here, to the home screen. Um, this home screen is where is your main portal to uh, download any apps on the Android-based system. We're going to go over to the Google Play Store right there, open it up, uh, accept the terms, and up at the top you'll see the magnifying glass. Click on that. From there you type in Directable. This is where we do our search for the Directable app. I'm going to skip a couple letters here just so you're not watching me type in the whole thing. But directable and then click search or even as we finish it it shows up. So from here you have the option to install the app. Click install and here it is loading, loading, it's finished. Click open and it brings us to this screen here. This is our startup screen. And you can see there you can go to directable.com slash trial just on your uh, computer and you can set up an account. Now when you set up that account, use that code in the lower right hand corner there, obviously it'll be different for you than it is for here, to connect this TV to that account. If you have an account, you can go to directable.com, log into your account, and you should be good to go. For any additional questions, go to directable.com, look us up, and send us an email or give us a call. Thanks.